Yo, YouTube, what is going on, everybody? Welcome to today's video where, ladies and gentlemen, we are here back on play.pvpcloud.net, the best Minecraft Skyblock server. And, ladies and gentlemen, I have a crazy announcement for you guys before we dive into today's video. Obviously, we're doing a lot of stuff today. We're doing some big giveaways. We're going to have a lot of fun, a big episode. But, ladies and gentlemen, I am excited to announce that your boy, Dazzer, is officially uploading daily videos here on this YouTube channel. And I just want to say this is going to be a fun little journey. We're going to see how long we can keep the streak going, uploading every single day. If you guys didn't know, I basically normally upload like every other day, but we are going to try it out. We're going to try to upload daily. So I want you guys to be part of this journey, making these videos and series part of your daily routine. So real quickly, if you guys are excited, comment down below. Let me know if you're going to be joining this journey. I'm going to need your guys' help. Cool video ideas, doing cool things with viewers. It's going to be a lot of fun, and I'm really looking forward to this. And it's going to be a challenge because my goal is to upload every single month in May. May, June, July, and August. So that's four months straight of daily uploading. And it, for every single day I miss, boys, I'm going to go ahead. We're going to start. The way it's going to work is like if I miss one day, that means I have to give away a thousand clouds. But then if I miss two days, then I have to give away 2,000 clouds. And so I guess we're basically, if I miss a day, every single day I miss over the next four months, I'm going to give away a thousand clouds per day. So hopefully, I mean, I guess you guys are going to technically want me to miss uploads. But let's just say, how about we do this? If I make it to the end of August after uploading every other day, Whatever the most liked comment is down below, that's the amount of clouds I'll give away. And we'll do like a massive giveaway. We'll do we'll do something fun. But I'm just trying to think of something fun. We're going to do a little challenge. So ladies and gentlemen, I hope you are excited because like I said, the next four months is going to be absolutely crazy. I want to go on this crazy journey with you guys. We're going to have so much fun with PvP Cloud, creating one of the best Minecraft Skyblock series on YouTube. It's going to be an absolute blast. So guys, real quickly, if you are new here, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Uh, and this is going to be a lot of fun. I know we kind of started this video off a little weird. But we do have some walker loot boxes that we're going to go ahead and start off because right now, if we take a look at IS top right now, we are currently IS top number 14. Things are actually looking pretty good for us right now. If you guys watched the last few episodes, we made a lot of progress in getting to IS top number 14. So that is looking really good at the moment. But we start want to start like getting to this next tier um, because we have to basically like double our worth to go from IS top 14 to 13. And then after we do that, even then, like we have to double it again. Like it gets kind of too difficult. Ideally, I want to get to like 500 mil value and then we'll be, or yeah, 500 bill value and then we'll be in like the top 10 so things should be looking good here soon ladies and gentlemen but let's go to open these walker loot boxes right now because like i said these we can potentially win some good stuff we can win silverfish spawners we can win some of the top spawners on the server which would be really really good besides piglins but okay boom we got a ton of money right there that was really good and we got a ton of tokens okay boom we'll take that let's just go ahead open this one right here and we got some polar bear spawners so that's good and let's go we got a ton of money right there okay you got some phantom crates as well that was really good and then finally the last walker loot box right here let's go ahead and see what we get and we got some mushroom cow spawners that's actually really really good and boom we got a ton of spawners there we got like 300 polar bears and 100 125 yeah that was an amazing opening right there okay boom that was literally perfect couldn't have gone any better and i'm actually really happy that we did get this epic cell one because i want to start utilizing cell ones on our farms because if you guys did not know if we do is visit dazzer yt you guys this is a public farm you guys could come here and grind we have two public farms set up on our island right here and if i sell all real quickly this farm is specifically the really op one we got piglins in here i mean we got all types of stuff in here and oh my gosh bro that proc and that made us a ton of money right there but yeah we have a ton of mobs in here so it's super super op like i said you can make a ton of money from this farm and our main goal has been just trying to upgrade our mob sword because upgrading our mob sword there's so many super op enchants that you can get and they like mob smashers super op looting is op tons of different enchants that are super op and that's what we've been grinding primarily and you guys see the amount of mobs that were spawning you have like 260,000 silverfish oh my gosh bro look at how many silverfish we're getting dude it's already th okay that's insane so that is really op and that's what we've been primarily focusing on here on the server and so we're gonna want to optimize these farms because the thing is i'm kind of debating technically speaking we like i right now normally just auto collect all my stuff and have it auto sell but the thing is is technically speaking if we grinded with looting and mob smasher and then we also went ahead and let that loot go into chests with those chests then the mobs would go ahead and collect all the loot and then we would be able to go ahead and use cell ones we could use our sets here because we obviously have a money set and we could use our pets here like there's a ton of different ways we could sell it 
Because right now we're really not making the most money possible just by like auto selling with our mob sword. So that's something I definitely want to explore in today's video is making like a super OP like sell system here. Because I feel like, like I said, that can make us a lot more money if I'm not mistaken. If you guys have any suggestions, let me know. But like, I just feel like that makes the most sense for us right now. And I did realize we won a legendary pet box. I haven't opened it. Let's just go ahead and see real quickly. Okay, we got a farming pet from that. Not too bad. We don't really need the farming pet right now. I mean, I guess it's good if we get another uh, pet slot unlocked because this boosts our farming skill XP that we get. It, we get it quicker so that could be really good because right now my farming skill low key is so mid yeah like my farming skill is so far behind compared to everyone else yeah we need to get that up but real quickly i believe we did get some hoe levels here and we can actually utilize these on our mobs or our hoe right now let's go ahead and place that on right there and boom there we go we maxed out our harvester hoe right there i don't think there's any more levels we could put on it yeah no it's already at max level right there so that's really good so sweet we like to see that we basically have a maxed out harvester hoe and we have a maxed out mob sword now uh in terms of their levels we still don't have our pickaxe or pickaxe is only level 65 but honestly i'm not too worried about that it's not really been the meta this season so i'm not i'm not wasting any tokens or anything on that but let's real quickly go ahead i'm gonna place down all these spots dude look at how many mobs are spawning dude what the heck yo is this correct bro i feel like the amount of mobs spawning is insane bro let's take a look at this bro oh my gosh yeah dude these things are spawning a ridiculous amount right now i don't know what we did i don't know if we did like a spawner booster or something holy guacamole though we went ahead and add some more spawners there that's good and we officially went ahead and impasse 200 billion dollars of worth so that's really good that's exactly what we like to see now we're just like about a hair away we're about a hundred billion dollars which is equivalent of well, i mean we have actually the money right now to go ahead and pass so i think we're gonna do that real quickly i got 1.5 trill and we do have the brand new piglin spawner um so i'm just gonna go ahead i think i could buy yeah two stacks of that right there boom there we go and if i'm not mistaken if i'm not mistaken oh wait no that wait i forgot okay wait we're actually a little bit farther out than i expected that only got us 10 bill value like i said we need to get to three so yeah we got a little bit of a way to go right there it's gonna be a little bit of a grind um but hey we'll go ahead and take it we're, we're slowly grinding we're gonna get there slowly but surely and there's someone on my island that was trying to give me some money and tokens earlier because i want to go ahead and do again some more upgrades on our mob sword so let me go ahead i'm gonna get that i'm gonna message him real quick it might be a little so i'll be right back um but yeah we're gonna go ahead get some more money and tokens that we could spend on our island right now and hopefully do some upgrades because then it'll be a little bit more op okay guys so i went ahead i was farming for a little while i was waiting for that but we ended up getting paid everything so we're at 3.57 trill money right now and 227 bill tokens to go ahead and upgrade our omni tool right now now the thing is about this is that we kind of ran into this issue in the last episode because we kind of figured out low-key like even just like grinding sugarcane right here like the amount of tokens you get is absolutely insane and so because of the amount of tokens we earn it's kind of like a conflicting thing where it's like okay we can earn a ton of tokens and like keep being able to get more because if we right click this we go to our harvester hoe right here the main chance we've been upgrading have been the token bonus which we do need to max out which i think we should be able to max out right now crop finder that's pretty good for making money but like again crops doesn't really make the most sense for making money so i'm not too worried about it at the moment yeah but basically all the token boost and chance we got token boost maxed out so really the only thing we need to focus on is token bonus now we can go ahead and upgrade this for 94 bill to max it out i think we're just gonna go ahead and do that i know it's like kind of a waste of money because i don't really afk a lot but i'm gonna be or not like afk you guys know what i mean like where it's like afk grinding where you put on another monitor so i'm just gonna max it out like we just did right there just for the sake so that we are maximizing the amount we earn from token bonus we'll see right here if i could get a proc i don't really know if we're gonna get one okay 10.3 i mean that's basically oh wait holy well we earned 11 mil up there so i don't really know i mean nor these ones right here are only three and two mil so i don't know if like 10 mil now will be like the normal proc 12 mil okay yeah maybe upgrading token bonus that, that was definitely worth it we're probably gonna have to get on the mine cart a little bit more often now but hey i'll take whatever we could get right now i mean this is pretty good we've upgraded our omni tool a pretty solid amount and that's really all you could ask for at the moment yeah dude look at this it's proccing a lot more and we got like a one mil proc there that's not really that good but like you guys get the general idea and we technically could i mean we could put another like 1500 levels in the crop finder it's just right now crops are not the meta for making money so i don't really want to focus on this and I, I mean i don't like obviously i mean i technically help with like what we should do each week i don't think we're gonna like make crops op a lot of you guys have said uh that the server it just isn't fun when like crops are the main money making it's good for making tokens but we need to make like mobs super super op so that's what we're gonna kind of do here that's like the main priority right now and so if we go back to ice visit dazzler yt um what i want to actually work on right now real quickly is we're gonna upgrade our omni tool we're gonna go to mob sword right here i want to upgrade mob smasher okay now the thing is with mob smasher i mean it's so expensive to upgrade i also want to do loot in 
Oh man, dude, this is tough. Because if we upgrade looting right now, we basically get another level. So that gives us another, like instead of two drops per mob, we're now going to get three drops per mob. And that's obviously super OP. I mean, that, that's insane. And so like that by default, I probably should just do. So here we go. $100 billion going into looting right there. That's actually insanely expensive. And now that we've went ahead and done that, what I think we're going to have to go ahead and do next, I'm guessing, I mean, I guess just put the rest in the mob smasher and try to increase that proc rate. We're only going to get two levels from this. But what I think I'm going to do right now is now that we're here, I'm going to go back to our, uh, and there's a harvester event going on right on the top of our screen. Uh, but what I think I'm going to do right now, Loki, is I think I might just like grind nether wart right now and try to collect a ton of tokens. Let me see if there's a mine cart here. But yeah, I think I might low key just do a little token grind right now because I want to get more tokens to put into our mob sword right now. I mean, it's going to cost what's 150 bill for the next level of Omni looting. I want to get more uh, mob smasher because I, I don't really like where it's at right now. We only have it level 15. So yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. Let me go ahead and put on my set. We're going to put on our token set real quickly. And then let's also go ahead real quickly and uh, we'll put on a token pet. And I also think we might put on a farming pet as well, just because then, I mean, we haven't really touched the farming pet, but we're going to get skills higher, the higher our farming skill is. I don't know how mine's so low right now, honestly. I feel like I'm not getting, wait, does this go up? I mean, our farming pet went ahead and leveled up right there, but like, is our skill level going up or is there like a glitch on the server right now? 13, no, it went up. Okay, I don't know. I feel like I've literally grinded a lot more than this. I don't know. That's kind of crazy. Maybe it's just a little bit more difficult to grind your skills this season compared to previous season. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do that because obviously the amount of tokens we can earn is kind of insane. And then I also am gonna go ahead and proc a token booster right now. And we got a lot of two times right here. I got an hour. So yeah, I think we're just gonna proc the personal token booster. I also low key could go to cloud shop right here, go to miscellaneous. We could also buy a global tokens booster. So I think that's what we're going to do. I'm going to buy a global tokens booster. I'll pop a per, uh, personal and we're going to make basically a ton of tokens over there. I'm just going to let my account. I'm going to watch an episode of like Smallville or something uh, and, and then I'll come back and we'll see how many tokens we have over like an hour. So yeah, let me go ahead and get my computer all set up for that. I'm going to do the F11 glitch thing that you can do here on the server uh, and hopefully we make a lot of tokens. We're at six bill right now. Let's see how many tokens we make after like an hour or whatever of like letting this AFK and grind or whatever. All right, guys. So after grinding right there for just a little bit over an hour i want you guys to comment down below and guess how many tokens we earned in just over an hour it's like an hour and like seven minutes so what is that like 67 minutes and again for reference we had the global 2.5 booster i had to buy two of them i technically bought three of them and then we also had the personal uh two times booster for an hour we also had my token set and we had a token pet right here to comment down below what you guys think but if your guess was 71.86 billion you were correct we were we were able to go ahead and hit that amount right there and that was really really good now we didn't really make a lot of money like i said it really isn't the best for like making money on the server but purely tokens 71 bill i will happily go ahead and take that and at this point again with our harvester hoe there's really no other enchants we need to get right now our main priorities have just been all the like token enchants and i feel like we've done all that so that's really good that's exactly what we like to see and now the main enchants that we're just going to focus on are on our mob sword and that's going to be looting turbo and mob smasher if you guys don't know what turbo is that increases the proc rate of enchants on our sword so mob smasher will uh, proc more frequently due to turbo but like that's my last priority enchant right now i'm not really focused focusing it. So if you go to Mob Smasher right here, we're going to be able to get four levels. Boom. That was very, very worth it. And now we have level 19 out of 25. We are six levels away from Mob Smasher being able to be um, maxed out. And then after we do that, we can focus on looting and turbo. That's going to be really, really good. And I'm actually going to throw a little bit of like the rest of my tokens into turbo right there because uh, that is going to be what level? Oh yeah. We have a long way to go on turbo, but yeah, overall very, very happy with uh, how everything has panned out. I feel like we got a really, really good sword right now. We're making really good progress progress on our omni tool at the moment uh, and that's really all you want all you could ask for man I, I i don't really know what else we need to do but guys let me know what else you want to see your boy grind here on the island i want to work on a new farm we're gonna be working on an 81 trunk farm in a future episode that's gonna be a ton of fun we got a lot of big things coming um and yeah let me know what you guys want to see there's also a big update coming out soon so we'll be able to grind that as well uh and tons of this new things here on the server so guys we're gonna go ahead and wind it off here on play.ppglad.net if you guys did enjoy today's video make sure you leave a like and subscribe I'll see you guys all in the next one here on the best Minecraft Skyblock server. And until then, bye-bye.